Today is April 5th, 2018, and our problems all started with this brand new washing machine, which we bought last Labor Day, which is what? Seven, eight months ago. So we came home from Arizona February 6th and um, found that the carpet on the other side of this wall was soaked with 30 gallons of water. And the water came <clears throat> from the back of this washing machine which was incorrectly installed and was leaking water. Actually, the guy forgot to tighten the hose. So, we called the insurance company and got to work. Remind, remember, this is February 9 when we call the insurance company and it is now April 5th. It was uh, carpeted. This is my office. Got a large desk here, which was jeans, <clears throat> and uh, a special custom-made desk ensemble that went from that corner all the way around this corner, and it custom-made, and it held everything. Three computers, scanners, fax machine, printers, the whole works. To give you an idea how big it was, uh, there you can see the top. That was the desktop, which has been taken out. Cody and I removed the carpeting in here and uh, all the furniture. And uh, we got rid of the soaking wet padding, called the insurance company, and they came in and saw that this entire wall was soaked. They had to cut the drywall out. Uh, four foot up, I'm sorry, two foot up, and we cut other various holes to inspect, see how far the water went. <clears throat> so because of the delay in getting this repaired, uh, we took the opportunity to paint this room after um, I hired a contractor to come in and do the drywalling, and so we painted it put uh, this portrait back up. We got yesterday, we put the uh, blinds back in and um, after cleaning those, and I have yet to nail this down, that's a new ductwork. The one that was in here is all rusted. And all the other ducts and plates and blah, 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 and all that stuff. All back in here. This, this room is ready for carpeting. And uh, unfortunately, they called yesterday and said the carpet will not be available until May. Woo, May. So let's look at the calendar. We come back from Arizona, February 6, call the insurance company February 9 if we find everything is soaking wet. So that's what? Two and a half months? May? <coughs> Terrible. So everything is thrown all over. This is our guest room, filled with stuff from the office. Doors and paneling and it couldn't be worse. There's shit everywhere. Can't move, can't have guests, can't do anything. End of our house, here's the living room, which has got all the drawers. <clears throat> and components for my custom desk assembly, all taken apart in pieces, sitting here. And of course, the contents of these drawers has all been stored in other boxes, but it's total mess. There's Gene's desk. Oh man, VCR, all my computer stuff, cameras, Everything just sort of stacked up, thrown everywhere. It's impossible to entertain, have guests. Place looks like like a shit house, really. And I've had to take over the dining room table as a temporary office, so I still have to communicate with China and customers here in the USA. So <clears throat> this was necessary. 
and uh, my color printer is here. Yeah, it's uh, not fun. I'm warm. <laughs> She's warm, so she took her shirt off, so I can't show you Jean. <laughs> I don't know what that's all about. Anyway, one of the big problems is <clears throat> this little piece of um, parquet flooring, which also is back ordered, and um, so I could gotta come in and do the parquet here, right up into the closet. Match it with the <clears throat> vinyl that's in the laundry room, and I want it to look like this. This is from 1990, and you can see the. Uh, parquet floor matches the vinyl exactly. <clears throat> I don't, how they're going to do that, I don't know. I don't remember how they did it back in 1990. But uh, there's no threshold or anything. And the problem is that the hardwood here and the uh, vinyl in the laundry room is not the same height, so a quarter inch difference. So when they put in the rest of this parquet, I don't know how they're going to match it up. <clears throat> but it better be the same as it was when we bought the house or built the house. So that's our problem. We are <clears throat> unable to have guests. Uh, wash machine has only been here for a day temporarily. I just told them we have to have the wash machine and dryer put in. We've been to the laundromat five times, got tired of it. And um, costs 28 bucks every time we go there. So <clears throat> that's our situation. Hope everybody had a good Easter. We went uh, visiting others because we couldn't entertain here. No. See you later. Latest update from New Berlin, Wisconsin.